Después de dos años de noviciado, 16 jóvenes profesan públicamente su voluntad, incluso su afán de luchar por la perfección cristiana. And what we look on here, it looks so easy. And what we talk about, it looks so easy and it sounds so easy. 16 young, enthusiastic, energetic young men have processed up this aisle. And it looks easy. But I wanted as we begin this mass to create an awareness of the true weight and the true value of this moment that we live and that we witness together. This present moment with a very real past, a very real past, and a moment with a future that is full of great hope and expectation, of dreams and ideals for these young men, and at the same time a future that is shadowed also by mystery. We begin this Holy Mass under our dear mother's loving and consoling gaze, Our Lady of Perpetual Help. You must wear the uniform of Christ. That's kindness, mercy, prayer, humility. That's gentleness, patience. That's our uniform, the uniform of charity. People don't want to see us. They want to see Christ. And if they want to see Christ, they want to see how much Christ loves us. And you are giving your lives, maybe in the best years of, of, of your life. You are so strong with enthusiasm, and you are giving the best you have. sacerdote dijo, si Dios les da un jardín tan bello, ¿por qué no le regalan una flor? Bueno, pues, él, él, él nos las pidió y se las dimos. Y se las, y se las entregamos. <risa> Bendito sea Dios. Estos jóvenes continuarán su formación estudiando humanidades clásicas en uno de los centros legionarios de España, México o los Estados Unidos.